Hey guys, Miss Jen from the Discovery Museum, and I have a fun activity here to go along with do something nice for your neighbor day. So I have some rocks here that I have been painting and decorating that I am going to be leaving on my neighbor's front steps. Um, I figure that this is a fun way for me to connect with them uh, and, and brighten their day. And even if they don't know it's from me, that's okay. Um, I was thinking about putting something on the back that maybe has the light bulb for the Discovery Museum since that's who I'm representing. But you could put your initials, you could put your name, you could leave it blank, you could put a secret message underneath, you could give them directions that they can take this rock and leave it for somebody else. Um, so I think that this is a really fun way to do something nice for your neighbor. So I have set up a little painting station for myself. So as you can see here, um, I have a space that uh, I can use to paint. I have um, my crate with all of my paints in it. I have my water. I have paint. Uh, I happen to have paint brushes off to the side here. And I have my rocks. Uh, and I also have a paper towel. Now, you know me, my rule is always paint with a smock. So I have my smock, I'm gonna put my smock on, make sure I don't get anything on my clothes. This is my handy dandy paint smock. And then I'm going to use the brush. Now I've painted some of my rocks so that they have a white surface on them. Now I'm going to take my brush and I'm going to add some detail. So maybe you want to add, now I happen to have all the colors of the rainbow. So maybe you want to take one of these and make a rainbow. Now I'm painting with the lightest color first, but you can you can use any color you want. Now I was thinking that I would also, I like flowers, so I'm going to paint some with some flowers on it. So maybe I'll take this one and make a bouquet of flowers. On that one. Um, now, you don't have to be a fantastic, amazing artist you are leaving some sunshine for your neighbors. They're going to be happy no matter what you paint and no matter how you paint it. And for all of you adults out there, imagine, if you will, now you may or may not appreciate Picasso, but imagine, if you will, that Picasso's mom came behind him and fixed all of his paintings. Can you imagine how disappointing the world would be? Disappointed? Um, that, uh, you know, his paintings aren't his own. They aren't original. So it's okay to leave your kid's artwork alone. Do not attempt to fix it. Kids, don't attempt to fix your adult's artwork either. I know it might be something you'd like to try to do to tell them how to do it. Let them be creative. Let them come up with their own ways to do things. I'm liking my uh, my rainbow, but it's becoming a little bit triangle-ish, and that's okay. Because remember, what's the goal? To bring some, spread some cheer, to bring some smiles to your neighbors' faces. That's it. You don't need to be Picasso <laughs> or any other famous artist. Now, I'm going to keep going with my artwork. And remember I said I'm going to sign the backs. So, um, I want you to go out, collect, see if you can collect some rocks in your neighborhood. Pick up the, the smoother ones, the better. Um, but if you don't have some very smooth ones, that's okay. Work with the bumps. Um, see if you can find some that have unusual shapes that you can create some images out of. This one was sort of a, a weird shape and it's perfect for a rainbow. Now, while you're looking out in nature for some rocks, see how far you can walk. See what animals you see. See what um, bird chirps you hear. Think about all the places you can write on the sidewalk, write special messages to your neighbors. Let them know that you are thinking about them, that you care about them, that you hope that they are smiling today. While you're on that walk, also see it, how many shapes you can find. Take a look at all the different trees that you can see. 
think about all the things that we've already learned together. Think about doing that. So I'm going to keep painting and I want you to keep painting too.